up you guys welcome back to the channel Ashley here just got Tay Tay CD where are you parked this way oh yes, you know just dodging cars but Tay Tay um so went to the JB Hi-Fi in town and they didn't have it and they said it was delayed till next week had a mini heart attack I was like I give up on Tasmania everything's always delayed but then Rosny pulled through they had the OG version and the vinyl and then I want to get the other versions next week. But happy Tay Tay release day. Like and subscribe. Lots of fun things going on today and this weekend. Yeah, woo! 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 Okay, I'm excited. I have to listen to the rest of the vault tracks. Yeah! This lighting. Okay. I haven't opened a CD in. Oh, you're recording. <laughs> yeah. Well, you can you can eat. It's okay. Um, I think the last CD I bought must have been like folklore or something. I kid you not. Did you not buy it more? I did for my dad. Oh. And I actually didn't get the Speak Now Taylor's version because I just assumed that they wouldn't have it in Taz. Yeah. And well, then, safe assumption after. Yeah. yeah. And then same with the Fearless. I didn't get. Mm. But like this is this is a monumental moment. This is this is the big time. Oh, it comes with a poster. Brilliant! It's going on my wall. Like the poster in there? Yeah. Tay Tay comes with all different things. Really? Yeah. Okay, so here's the CD. Just came out today, 3 p.m. Australian time. That's the one thing I love about being in Australia is um, CDs or like music in general just comes out midnight East Coast time, but 3 p.m. At least currently. Look! She's so cute. Cute. Very much summer vibes. Wait, what's the writing? Uh, welcome to New York. Here you go. That goes Are you in. Are you gonna put it in? Oh. This is a monumental I moment. haven't used a CD thing in a while. So. 17, please. Gotta start with the vault tracks. Okay, check in a bit. And honey, all of the above, please, but only if it's dairy free. Coffee please and thank you. Plus, honey. plus happiness. They've got half the equation on there. Happiness. They actually had a dairy free cake. We stand. Do you want to get a video of me consuming it? Yeah. Okay. So. Now you're recording. Thank you. 
tastes like anything. Like it doesn't taste like, it tastes like water. Does that make sense? Um, it's mostly water. That's really good though. Okay, does that taste like water? No, that's good. Roll back at Devil's Corner, because like this view is insane. I will never get sick of it. It is stunning. Let's see if this audio picks up. Okay. Super excited and they even had dairy-free pizza. Look at this view. Are you excited? I'm so terribly excited. Yum. Oh, we need to scan the QR code. Yeah, but they have the QR code. Yeah. You know, it's actually really, really nice. Very innovative. Oh. We are back. I remember this being my favorite when I came here with the fam, but we just had a super yummy vegan pizza. I was not expecting them to have vegan cheese. Like I was expecting to just have like a flatbread. We were just gonna have bread and sauce. Yeah. With some leaves but, on it. But then with chicken. <laughs> like chicken flatbread. No, they have vegan cheese and it really hit the spot. So this is the cuvee. I remember really liking, I'm pretty sure I got a bottle of this one when I came with the fam. Mm-hmm. Mm. It's really light. Oh, that's really like zingy though, like mm. citrusy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And um, pairs well with butter popcorn and salt and pepper squid. Apparently. Solid. We love salt and pepper squid. No, nope. No seafood for me, please. Absolutely not. No. Even though we've already had this wine before, their Pinot Noir Rosé, we're about to remind ourselves how a wine can taste crunchy. Okay, go. Three, two, one. Buffalo. <laughs> Does it taste crunchy? It's so crunchy. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Does it taste crunchy? Oh, you're hungry. Oh, I don't mind. Uh oh. Flip. <laughs> Camera pass. <laughs> Crunch, 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 crunch. Did you get any broken glass in there? No. Oh, I think that's what they meant. <laughs> I mean, I already know I like this one. Yeah, it's already classic. But I don't know classic. how it's crunchy. It's very scullable. I'm kind of confused. Now I want to Google this. What makes a wine crunchy? Or we could ask them, but Google's fun. What? Write down in the comments what makes a wine, a wine crunchy. crunchy. We're dying to know. <gasps> Dog. Oh, cute puppo. Zoom. Oh, wait, it's like an actual thing. Describing a wine as crunchy, crunchy usually refers to a vibrant acidity. It's similar to saying the wine has a snap. You can't, it's a liquid. <laughs> <laughs> but it has a snap. It's got a snap, crackle, and pop. Mm -hmm. Usually associated with white wines. That's so funny, actually. I mean, I get it. Yeah. But like, I don't know. When I think you know crunchy, what? I think an apple. Yeah, but to yeah. be fair, if they if they want to do that and they want to describe their wine that way, it's still more creative than Felino's tasting notes. <gasps> We've been cut off. <laughs> <laughs> this video is not sponsored by Felino. <laughs> I think there's a lot of like climbing spots around here as well. So pretty. We are in Frasenay. Oh, elk. Yeah, elk, deer? Elk. Do you have elk or deer? We definitely don't have elk. What about, <laughs> what about deer? Yes. You guys have deer. Yes, yeah. deer. Yes, deer. <laughs> Whatever. Drinking on some wine now at the little Airbnb. Got some Devil's Corner. And then... Oh, is that them? Mm -hmm. Maybe? and then got some pizza from Geograph, just down the road. Pretty good. Um, oh, people. So pretty, we're at the lodge, the Freysene Lodge, for some drinks. So pretty. That's the sticks that people pick up 
and use on their walk and stuff like that. Um, and then they ditch them. Look how pretty! <laughs> Hawaiian Glass Bay, look out. So happy to finally make it. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not used to having an audience. I'm not used to having an audience when doing this. Uh, I finally made it to Frasenay. It's only taken me a year and a half, but we finally made it and here's the vlog. <laughs> 